put a diet, but it's really it's just going to be a life changer for me. Um, but no animal products, no dairy. beautiful day and God is pouring all this love onto the earth um, to, to revitalize, to, to renew, to give growth and life. It's a beautiful morning. <clears throat> um, I started this, thought about this journey and decided to give it a challenge. Um, Dr. C.B. died um, and those who don't know Dr. I'm gonna take a look at that too. <clears throat> I'm a medical profession. I can I can um, de de decipher through the language. So um, I did, and I, I went. I just you know pulled up some lectures from Stanford. Pulled up some lectures from um, Penn State Medical School, um, and you know I did that research too. And what I found was cardiologists and immunologists and biologists, etc. All of them were talking about the same thing, and that's inflammation. Inflammation, the root of all evil. So I am on this journey to rid my body of inflammation. And one of the things um, um, to start that journey is changing diet. So if that means you know, going towards a plant-based diet, um, listen, why not give it a try? I mean, we as um, a rush society, uh, we want everything right then, right then. We want to, um, we get us, we get sick, we want to take a pill. Well, you know what? There's a place for pills. And when I say pills, I'm referring to modern medicine. But there is a place for that. Um, but what about preventative medicine? Um, what about, um, you know, the steps that we take before we get to that point? Before we get to that um, situation where we're in need of that pill? Um, and certainly there's a place for that too. And, um, you know, so we have to start taking care of ourselves um, and stop um, depending on some other miracle drug to um, solve our problem for us. Um, so, this is my journey. Day three. 